So here's me in Super Dink. I'm going to uh, chase bubbles. I know where they are. They're at exactly the other side of where I'm pointing the camera now. <laughs> so at the reverse side of what you guys are seeing. So I'm going to go a bit more ahead because I've been down now for half an hour. And I'm going to check because in about 15 minutes they'll be coming up again. So let's slow down speed a bit and see if we can get close to the reef and then I'll shut the engine off again. Hey, they'll be catching up with me because they're moving this away direction. So guys, how is that? I'm just here on a dinghy uh, in the middle of nowhere. Look, there's, there's only ocean here. There's nothing, there's nothing else. It's just me and a dinghy and the divers are down. You know, I'll be picking them up in a few minutes. 15 minutes or so, it'll be done. So I wanted to say hi and um, this is totally blinding my eyes, so I need to put my um, this away direction. You can see me better. Oh, no, that's, yeah. Okay, so um, I wanted to say a quick hi here for me to um, yeah. I see the bubbles are straight ahead of me. So uh, for you guys behind me which is not obvious as this is a mirror effect, but they are on the other side of this. <laughs> it's so funny. Anyways, I just wanted to say hi because it's, uh, it's, it's so remotely beautiful out here and there's, what, what is there to say? But um, an amazing amount of water. This morning we were swaying on the boat on... Uh, he's actually all the way over there. I'm not sure if you guys can see this little sticky pointing out from the horizon. Do you see the waves on the other side? Breaking on the reef. And here in the front you might be able to see the bubbles. That's where the divers are. So they're the little sticky. That's downtime over there. And then on that side there's a big pontoon. It's, it's sort of like a big station and there's some helicopter pontoons where people can come by helicopter to, to dive and um, either maybe connect their boats or their boats with a pontoon, I don't know. So whatever that is. Um, I am, um, here's some birds, there's fishies over there, feeding time. Sometimes something comes up here and it just comes up and it's really beautiful. You see turtles, uh, sea turtles everywhere. Um, we were at Bait Reef yesterday, and there it was really like a massive amount of tur water turtle, sea turtle over there. And over here, uh, look, there's a bit of mainland over there. Woo! That's far away, isn't it? That's really far away, guys. It looks maybe you guys can't even see it because I know that when you take video, it's it's even more uh, difficult, you know, to to comprehend what kind of a distance that is. Or it won't even show. So I'm here on the middle of the big blue. This is the South Pacific Ocean. Isn't that awesome? This is the South Pacific Ocean. The Great Barrier Reef. Coral Sea we went over. We came all the way um, from Coomera. So we've been sailing quite some miles. And um, been here now, uh, what's the day today? It's about, it's been two and a half weeks or something. Yeah, because it's weekend, right? So, um, yeah, it's been almost, um, almost three weeks. So, five weeks to go. And the crew is changing next week. I'll be, um, I'll be with the captain on the ship for a week. And then new crew is coming in. And probably going to move north to Cairns after about two weeks or something. Yeah, I've got to get a bit on a move, so I'm starting the engine. Look, that's how this stuff works here. Because otherwise it's going to be... Um, otherwise I'm going to lose track of them. I do not want ones, because they might be coming up. Oh, there they are. Just so I know where they are. 
so I'm totally in my element guys I'm totally on the sea I'm getting loads and loads and loads of uh, beautiful pictures information communication healing I believe I have already been to hell and back in my first week when I came out so I was greeted fantastically by uh, by the sea and as she called me out here I'm positive I was asking questions if it was something I needed to do or to be for this water which was uh, just heavy and then is it something that I needed to just receive and be and that was really light so I started out with being just that and not making any fuss about it and um, I'm not getting stuck here, am I? Oh, turn her off like this. 71. So, I've got them straight ahead now. I'm hoping that... Because the boat's being uh, pushed out from the reef uh, pretty fast, actually. Even though it seems like all the wavies are coming to me, I'm being pushed out to the other side. So there's a current coming in, like, from that way. The wind's blowing me out that way, which is interesting, right? So that was new for me to get acquainted with all this current stuff. Yeah. So yeah, what was I saying? Um, yeah, well, I got out here and immediately I got into a sort of like an emotional roller coaster, which was, um, well, you could say hideous really. Oh, that was not funny. But anyway, I, I couldn't really eat much and I couldn't really do much. I didn't have any appetite. I didn't have any feel for anything. So, approaching the 45 minutes, I might as well keep that engine on though. I don't want to lose them out of my sight now. So, yeah, um, water facilitation is humongous, and um, many people are facilitated by water without knowing it. Uh, when you become conscious and aware of what you're doing, um, there is so much more out there. Where did they go? I'm being blown off. Are they going in there? Okay, they're going into a little uh, passage, I see. That's cute. I'm sticking around there for a while. Okay, yeah, so what else can I say? Um, I had a bit of a... Well, you know... Facilitation from the water also it brings you in like this uh, confrontation with your own true shit, which actually happened for me like immediately when I got here. And um, having been deprived of a lot of sleep, actually being pretty exhausted before I left, and having such an idiot, um, an idiot kind of. Uh, Yeah, well, it's, uh, it's, it's it, this idiot kind of, uh, I'm not coming up because I see more bubbles. Uh, I've got to keep an eye on those guys over there. Anyways, but uh, what I wanted to say was, uh, there's always this, um, uh, I was so tired, I was really exhausted when I I slept like for about two days. I slept through the whole uh, launch of the boat. They just let me sleep, which is normally it's not really allowed to have any people on the boat while it's being launched, but they just let me sleep. Is she going to wake up? No, she's not going to wake up. So as long as I wasn't dancing around on the, you know, that was going to be good. Yeah, so uh, this was sort of my... 
my game. My uh, water facilitating me immediately when I came here was also uh, a good welcome. I was glad I got that welcome because I needed it. And uh, got an awesome captain here who's uh, very considerate. So it sort of like gets like if you need a nap, go get a nap. So I'm sort of like resting a lot and facilit being facilitated by the sea. I'm receiving information from the sea, which I know for sure. And um, and I think at the moment I am facilitating the sea. I'm also facilitating the boat, I'm facilitating crew, and not in a deliberate way. I'm not really aware of that. But sending out lots of energies and uh, that kind of stuff. And there's, um, they have to be coming up soon, so I'm going to stop the video in a second so it just stops. I uh, want to say to you guys, Mediterranean coming up in May, we're going to do new water whispering programs and I'm really, really, really looking forward to it. I've had so much fun last year and looking at people who were with me then, who chose for that, who actually made that choice to do that with me, they have absolutely made breakthroughs in their lives that have, well, that's going to have like a lot and 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 a lot of more, um, I think there's someone coming up, there we go, that's going to have consequences for these lovelies and, uh, I don't have any meters. How is that possible? I can see you guys coming up.